Guys, we're back with Aquatics Galore. We have product here we haven't gone over yet. It's been out for a while. This is the Vortec MP40. They also make an MP10 and an MP60. Nice thing about the MP Ecotex is the cord stays out of the aquarium. This whole part right here stays outside of the aquarium where this part goes inside. And there's also something better than that. This part that goes in the aquarium has a sleeve that goes over it. So you gotta think, it's a second filter. A lot of people don't really think of it like that, but everything that's being pumped through this and back out, you are now filtering, and you're getting a couple thousand gallons an hour, which is huge. So this acts as a second filter. You wanna take these off, clean them out, replace them pretty often, because if you're pulling a bunch of water through it and you're using power to create waves in the tank, why not clean your tank at the same time? Two birds, one stone. What I really like is if you attach this to the outside of the tank, this to the inside of the tank, it's got a real powerful magnet on it. You can pop this off, soak it in vinegar to clean it, grab a replacement, and you can get these fairly cheap, around 100 bucks. You get a backup, you put back on the tank, you're up and running, Why the other one's sitting in vinegar, soaking, getting all the nastiness out of it. And then you pull it out of the vinegar, rinse it off, clean it off, set it to the side. When the one in the tank gets dirty, swap them out again. Really nice, really nice feature. Now you have a controller. And you can manually control it with this controller or... You can control it with your Android phone. I was thinking there's going to be a little bit more... Uh, details on that let's see what's in the packaging details on how to connect it so it does have the mobius it is smart app controlled so there's a lot of different settings on it and that's what this is going over here so you've got Tidal swell mode, and it shows you a pattern of what it's doing, the intervals in between the pulsing. Nutrient transport mode. Short pulse mode. So it's just going to be a bunch of quick pulses. That's going to create the most waves for you. Gyre mode, for those gyre fans. Reef crest random mode. So this is just going to constantly switch it up so nothing's the same. Probably going to be the best mode you can do. And then Lagoonal Random Mode, but that isn't, you can tell that this one's going to create a lot more waves with the random pattern that that one has. So that's going to be the one that's really going to help keep the detritus out. And then uh, you got troubleshooting on the back. So they come with Velcro for mounting. Uh, I call these sticky backs. I honestly don't know what they're called. We could probably read the manual and probably tell us what they what they're actually called but I've always called them sticky backs let's uh, figure a yeah it just says peel the back from the adhesive tab so doesn't tell you what it's called oh, mounting tabs all right they call them mounting tabs I call them sticky backs but you can put these on the tank and use the zip ties that it comes with to connect the cords and then your velcro to attach the controller wherever you want on the tank so that is the vortec mp40 really really suggest it uh, love the product we've been installing them for years haven't done a video so we wanted to get this on the line for you have a good one